Let me, let me tell you something. Tony's forecast has not changed in the last three hours, so don't think he's working too hard out here. <laughs> yeah. okay. The focus now turns to who Obama and McCain will select as their running mates. Who should be Barack Obama's choice for vice president? Well, that's something that he has to make. How about Hillary Clinton? How about Ben Cardin? No, I'm very happy in the United States Senate. Could we be calling you Vice President Kane in the near future? I think that's very unlikely, Steve. Let's just say that the phone rings at the governor's mansion one night, and it's Barack Obama, and he says, you know what, I want you to be my vice president. What are you going to say? Is it one of those 3 a.m. phone calls you're talking about? <laughs> well, look, compared to global prices, we're getting a bargain. Well, but do you think the U.S. consumers are going to buy into that? Well, about $7 billion a month, according to the figures the president released during his address to the nation tonight. The president made it very clear he wants to take every step possible to continue this campaign against terror. Uh, Mohammed questioned him a few times and said, well, didn't you testify to this? Didn't you testify to that? Malval responded, I lied through most of what I had told detectives in the past. Now, let me set the stage a little bit as to what folks are going to see later today here on the Florida International University campus. When you first found out yesterday how high the death toll was, what was the initial feeling among the students? Was it a feeling of anger? Was it a feeling of sadness? To find a proper way to respond to this, I think, right. is a process that continues to evolve. Indeed. At the same time, there are those critics who say this was mishandled. Mm -hmm. How do you respond to that? You know, there were warnings. This is the paper from New Orleans the day before the storm hit. It says, Katrina takes aim and look at the small print. Officials strongly urging residents to leave. Levees could be topped in the entire metro area. We want to talk a little bit about the mass itself, the structure of the mass, the message of the mass. When you look back now on this second time around with the Redskins, what do you think about now? Do you think it was the right thing to do? I think it was the right thing to do. Steve is the... Oh, very nice. It's it's tough in the dress shoes. What's that? Are you in dress shoes? In the dress shoes. What's... I mean, it's not beyond me to do some of the things that this guy does in the, in the thing. Uh, Such as? I don't know, throwing a brick through a window. <laughs> Did you know at the time that 24 was going to be as big as I it is I was the now? first one that was cast on the show. Why do you always play such twisted characters? Well, they're fun to play. Does that mean this is it for Rocky? Oh yeah, I have to. You think I'm going to that beating again? <laughs> Does she ever say, honey, you're going a little too fast right now. You just need to slow down. <laughs> Never. The president of the Washington Nationals, kind enough to join us this morning. It seems like when everybody got together to plan this ballpark, you guys collectively trying to take the fans' view of things. Yeah. You feel more pressure to make sure that now that we especially have a winning club since we have the new ballpark to show well, up? Well, we felt pressure from day one to build the best team we could. That's why we're here. The series returns to Cleveland on Wednesday. It is a must-win game five. Game five? What is this? That's well, that's uh, me and Ashley Simpson from the White House Correspondence Dinner. Don't know how that how did that get in there? Oh, yeah. oh my goodness, that was Saturday night. Home All right, uh, no continue fun. with the sports now, please. The Washington Redskins have not had <laughs> many draft picks lately. Wow, I don't know where that came from. All right, on the racetrack, it was a great. What is this? Is that me with Ben Affleck and Jennifer Garner? Oh my god. Really? This is getting I'm embarrassing, getting folks. Are these real? It photos? looks like I'm just showing off here. Yeah, yeah. it really this is does. This crazy. Jennifer Garner is so pretty. Isn't she, though? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Ben was a little disturbed because she was giving me a little too much attention. Yeah, well, he was looking yeah. on this I way. Because he was upset. He didn't okay. want to look at me. Well, he should be. Yeah, he should be. All right. Thanks, Steve. <laughs> Cheers, guys.